Hi everyone. I'm standing in front of the uh, Paris Hotel in Las Vegas, getting ready for my Las Vegas trip workout. And it's probably the quietest time of day you're going to find here in Las Vegas, but it's not quiet at all. There's cars, there's people. They're interesting at this time of the morning. Got the uh, Arc de Triomphe behind me and Eiffel Tower on this side. And lots of stuff going on already. So I'm wearing my new sweat pink tank and I'm waiting for my Garmin to get a signal and then we're off for the workout. <laughs> Come along with me. First point of note is you can get a lot of stair workouts in this city. Here we are, the first bridge over. Most of the busy streets have bridges to help with the traffic, which it doesn't too much. That's the idea. So I'm crossing over the Las Vegas Strip. Few people hanging, few people coming home. A little scary, but it's daylight and there's lots of people around here. <laughs> Just so you know, there are others like me. Next stop, I'm on the corner of Las Vegas Boulevard and Tropicana, one of the busiest intersections here. We've got the MGM Grand, we've got New York, New York, in all its strange splendor. Got Excalibur, Excalibur in this corner. And at this time I've done four flights of stairs and I'll probably have at least double that by the time I'm done. Now as I stand here back on level ground, about a mile into the run, so I'm good and warmed up. Not to mention that it's 91 degrees here at about six o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna kick it up a notch. I'm warm. I've got about a half mile to go to Mandalay, Mandalay Bay, so I'm going to pick up my pace and see if I get a little interval in. Let's go on this Las Vegas workout. Made it to the Mandalay Bay, a little bit less than half a mile, but enough for me simply because it's hot. Did I mention that? Now about a mile and a half into the run. I'm also at the southernmost portion, portion of the interesting part of the strip. So. I'm going to turn around, head back. Remember the Luxor? That used to be the most different thing in Vegas. <laughs> it's been a while. I'm going to head north, back towards my hotel and a little beyond. This is one of the most Las vegas -y things they can do, and they do it a few times here. We've got road construction going on, so they detour you through the casino and the bars. So a quick tour of the MGM Grand. It is air conditioned, so that's good. I guess we actually get to avoid the casino. I have to go by Starbucks though, which is a challenge and I haven't had my coffee yet. Here on yet another bridge. I will admit I'm kind of walking at them now, but I've done about eight, so I have some excuse. I'm actually feeling pretty strong. I took my energy this morning, and uh, they make me feel awesome. But it is really hot here. I did do another interval, and I averaged about an eight-minute mile, which was pretty cool. Um, half a mile of it, basically from bridge to bridge. That works really well have a kind of community here with both the other runners and walkers 
who you smile at and kind of look knowingly because they're thinking the same things you are about this city. And also even, I've had a lot of high fives from a lot of drunk men this morning. It's been kind of fun. So that was the Las Vegas Strip Workout. I'm here in front of Bally's. I've run three miles. I've done two intervals, about eight minute pace. It's over 90 degrees. I've passed a lot of interesting people. I've got the Bellagio across the street. Unfortunately, the water display just finished. Otherwise, I'd have gone across and shown you that. It was very cool if you've never seen it. I've got Caesar's Palace, one of the old standbys, valleys, and the Flamingo, one of the really, really old standbys. So that's it for the Las Vegas workout. If you're here and it's cooler, you can get another couple intervals in. I'm just a little bit beat up by this uh, temperatures today. But I hope when you come to Vegas, you'll stay up maybe a little later than me, but get up early enough so you can enjoy Las Vegas early morning.